I had to make this video. I just, I, I've always had this thought. I've always thought that Kenny Porter, I just don't think he knows what he's doing. I think he's a clown. Okay, I do. In terms of like boxing, do you know what I mean? Listen, his son's done well to get this far. You know, I'm not trying to discredit him too much, but, um, you know, he's, he's, he's good with the conditioning stuff, isn't he? He gets Sean Porter in shape and uh, he always comes to fight, doesn't he, Sean Porter? But I, he, he fights the same way. Do you know what I mean? He's wild. Um, I've not seen any improvements. Um, what's it called? I, I don't know what the training, training uh, Sean Porter. I don't, know what they, I, don't know, I don't know what they're doing in that camp. Do you know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, uh, like Porter, I respect Porter. I respect Sean Porter because... Dealing with a dad like that, fucking hell, man. Uh, I feel sorry for the guy. Do you know what I'm saying? The guy, um, he just needs to man up now. And, and uh, he, he's, he's saying that he's retired. I think that he's, he's only doing that. I think he's, just, he's had enough of his dad, hasn't he? Do you know what I mean? Especially after what he said at the post-fight press conference. I mean, you know, he, you know, he stopped the fight, didn't he, in the 10th. Um, you know, I don't do I have a problem with that. Nah, listen, he's people saying that he knows his son, he's doing it because he loves his son, blah blah blah. Okay, whatever. I'll I'll give him a pass for that, you know what I mean? I don't want to see Sean Paul hurt, you know. Crawford is a good finisher, isn't he? You know, when he has you, he finishes you, doesn't he? And you know, Crawford's a guy who it's just he's he's good, isn't he? I mean, he made I mean I can't quit, didn't he? Like, not by knocking them out, but outboxing him, do you know what I mean? He make that's why Khan when he got that a bit that low blow, he don't want he don't want anything after that, did he? He knew he was gonna get stopped. Um what's it called? So maybe um Sean Paul, you know, saw like in, in, you know what I mean, like his first time um um probably um Porter's been hurt that badly, hasn't it? But I thought he could have continued a bit, but like I said, there's nothing wrong with that him stopping a fight. It's what he's saying afterwards, um, saying that he knew it's gonna happen because he didn't prepare uh, properly. I'm, I'm thinking to myself, you're his fucking trainer. You're his trainer, mate. What do you mean he's not prepared? You're supposed to prepare him for the fight. Do you know what I'm saying? Sean's always prepared, isn't he? Though in terms of like his fitness and um, you know he's he's always ready, isn't he? He's ready to go twelve rounds. You know what I mean? He's always prepared. I've watched a few of the fire hype videos of him training in the mountains and shit like that. So his fitness, everything, he, lo he looks prepared to me. So him saying that he's not prepared, then it's, it's on you, Kenny. Sorry. You're his fucking trainer. Do you know what I mean? And then he can't just um, take the credit when he's winning. You've got to take the... you got to take it when he loses as well. Do you know what I mean? Um, and when it comes down to it, he's lost every, the big fights, the elite fights. He's lost, and he? he lost to Thurman, didn't he? He lost to Spence close, um, you know. I mean Crawford. Now he gave Crawford a good fight. Do you know what I mean? He was in the fight until that knockdown. Do you know what I mean? So he's always pushed him really hard, but it's just something's missing, isn't there? There must there's something missing, isn't there? And I think that's to do with the train. I think he he needs to. I don't think he really wanted to retire. I think I think he just needs to get another trainer. I think I was listening to. Uh, Tank Davis speak and he's saying the same thing. He's, he's well. He said that um, I think Sean Paul is gonna be back fighting again. I think he just needs a rest because he's just been training so hard. I know because they, I know um, with the Porters they train all year round, don't they? Do you know what I mean? Sean's constantly training, so all this because like, that's what I'm saying. All this he's not prepared bullshit. It's, it's bullshit. It's just he lost to a better skilled fighter. Simple as that. And um, and and Kenny Porter just needs to. Just chill out and shut up. Uh, if I was um, Sean Porter, I'd get rid of his dad. Um, but, you know, take some time out now and then come back boxing again. Do you know what I mean? Because he's got potential. He's still a good fighter. He's still he's still going to be in good fights in that division. He's just got to, I feel like he's got to try something different. Change trainers. See if it works. If it doesn't work out, then, you know, it is what it is, isn't it? But there's nothing wrong with that. Sometimes you just need change. And, uh... I feel like uh, Kenny Paul is he's a bit overrated as a coach. Like I said, fitness wise, gets gets um shown in shape. Do you know what I mean? But apart from that, it's technique stuff. I remember he's doing that blindfold shit and all that. Come on, man. I don't know, man. I I just don't rate him as a as a coach that highly. You know what I mean? He's always done something right to get shown this far. But I feel like Sean as well. He's 
his talent has taken him that far as well. Do you know what I mean? So, you know, listen, I give credit to him, but I still think Sean needs a new trainer. I feel like that's just what it is. I think he's had enough of his dad. He's tired of his dad. Do you know what I'm saying? He's tired of him. Simple as. We're tired of him. Seeing his face all the time, taking Sean Shine away. It's done, man. It, he needs he needs a new trainer, man. Take your time off, Sean. Take a, a year out or something. And if you feel like coming back, come back, but come back with a new trainer. And that's it. Do you know what I'm saying? Your dad's well off anyway. He's made money. So you, you do you now. It's your time now. 